All right, good morning. Wonderful to see so many folks, friends from Ingram, partners around the world, former colleagues, current colleagues, people I've worked with for so many years from a couple of different perspectives. Uh, before we get into the slides, let me start with a quick introduction of myself. In case you're wondering about my strange accent, although I think it's pretty normal, um, I am born and raised in Europe, in Denmark, and for the last 25 years I've worked in the tech sector, hardware, software, cloud, B2C and B2B, uh, and I lived and worked in Europe, Middle East, Africa, and now for the last almost 10 years here in the US. Now, um, a year ago actually, I was supposed to do a keynote here in this summit, um, but a couple of days before, I fell off my bicycle and got carried by an ambulance into a, a hospital and spent some time there. So it's a pleasure to be here this year. I don't have a before and after like the mesh early on with the, with the hair story, but I do have a lot of stainless steel now in my arms. So what I'm going to start the morning with is ask all of you to help me to do my morning stretch exercises. All right, so you ready? You ready? Yes. Okay, good, good, good. So we are going to um, go through some numbers. So first of all, I'd like to ask you, for any of you who are a Dropbox user today, could be the free version, paid for version, at work or at home or at play, can you put up your left arm? Wow. You are part of now half a billion people plus across the world who are registered users of Dropbox. Half a billion. By the way, thank you. This is incredible. I didn't do an exact count, but I think it was 721 I saw in this room, roughly. So 62.3%, roughly. Uh, great to see. Let's try the next one. For all of you that use Dropbox, do you use Dropbox somehow together with some other tools like Slack, Facebook Workplace, Office 365, G Suite or something else? If you do, can you put up your left hand? That is awesome to see. You are part of an incredible thing that's happening every day. Every day at Dropbox, thousands of vendors, ISVs, cloud developers, large companies, small companies who have integrated their IP APIs into ours so our solutions work well together, are allowing you to do amazing things integrating your work and your apps into getting a great user experience. We at Dropbox every day have around about 2 billion API calls. If you think about that on an annualized basis, that's three quarter of a trillion API call a year. It speaks to the power of a massively integrated platform. So great to see that so many of you are getting the value out of that as well. The third one, so <clears throat> many of you put up your hands saying you're using Dropbox, and many of you put up your hands saying you're using it integrated together with other great technology solutions such as Office 365. Now, what I'd like to see is by a show of left hand, how many of you are also a drop paying Dropbox business customer? That is awesome to see. Thank you very much for your business. It is very much appreciated. For the rest of you, can I have your business card? All right. <laughs> uh, look, um, we um, as Dropbox started um, almost 10 years ago, actually in early next month, 10 years ago as a company. Uh, we initially were in the um, B2U space. Back then it was called the B2C space, but I think the real term for it is business to user. We were focus on, focusing on providing a simple, straightforward, delightful experience to users to really enable them to go about their lives at work, at home, and in between, and having a delightful experience. Now, around about, um, <clears throat> around about four years ago, we launched our first team offering that became our business offering, that then also became our enterprise offering. And in just a few years, as a matter of fact, just in two years, our business offering, Dropbox Business, got to 100,000 companies as paying customers. Just as a proxy to give you a sense of how fast or slow that is, that took 
Salesforce 10 years. We did it in two. And it just shows you that collaboration is becoming absolute core to businesses across the world. Um, so, um, you know, coming after the IDC presenter, Pam, great presentation, thank you. Uh, I have to have an IDC slide in my deck. Um, and I did want to share with you something pretty exciting, something that we're very, very proud of at Dropbox, and really speaks to the tremendous business opportunity for all of you as resellers, MSPs, CSPs in this audience. Dropbox, according to IDC, announced a couple of months back, is the fastest SaaS company to reach a $1 billion revenue run rate. Faster than such esteemed com companies such as ServiceNow, Workday, and Salesforce. So tremendous momentum in our business, but this is not the end of the beginning. This is just the beginning of the beginning. And I'm here today to share with you the unbelievable opportunity that we see in the market and how I think we together can tap into that. So as I mentioned, billion dollar revenue run rate already. As a company, we're also very proud that we are cash flow positive, And we certainly believe that all of that is a way of customers out there, companies out there saying collaboration is core to how we run our business and how we get our job done. So <clears throat> we believe in some very simple foundations for our business. We believe in user first. We believe in user centricity. That's easy to say, right? But it's not all that get it right. We believe we have got it right, and half a billion registered users plus speaks to that. Looking at the, um, what did you call it, Pam, the, uh, the lying down eight earlier on? That was talking about the life cycle of customers. Yeah. The infinity loop, that's it, thank you. I should remember that. Um, I love that, and I think it speaks to a very new reality out there, which is, it's not just the customers are out there um, finding a solution, trying it, and then buying it. I actually think there's another loop I would add to your infinity loop, or another component I would add to your infinity loop, which is the notion of finding it, trying it, and then using it. And then one day, perhaps after a day, or perhaps after a year, or perhaps after a few years, that user then is saying, you know what? I can see there's some additional value in buying a pay for paying for a paid version. Now I'm gonna now I'm gonna share some of my, my money with vendor X, Y, and Z, in this case Dropbox. So we certainly believe that there's a tremendous opportunity in the notion of being user-centric and providing a simple, straightforward, delightful solution uh, for the users out there. And again, more than half a billion seeing it, using it across the world. That represents opportunity for you. It means that you have half a billion plus users out there that take Dropbox to work every day in more than 8 million businesses, of which only around about 200,000 so far have bought a Dropbox solution. Wouldn't it be neat together to go out and sell to those other 8 million businesses that are already using the solution, where many of the employees already are bringing it to work every day? They know the value already. So, big opportunity for us together there. The way I work has become very different. Um, I used to be an OCD email, emailer, com obsessive compulsive emailer, hundreds of emails a day. Uh, and whilst I somehow, in some sick kind of way, enjoyed it, um, perhaps you do as well, the frustration with email is it's just too disconnected. It's just too siloed. It's just too difficult. It takes too much time. But first and foremost, the problem is by the time you hit the button for reply and you start typing, that's already out of sync. It's already out of date. It's already kind of irrelevant because four other people may be sitting in different parts of the world or in your same office and sending a reply on the same string. And you end up being disconnected, not really collaborating, not really being joint at the hips in terms of how we're working together. So the whole linear type of work, of process and sharing, in the old world, so to speak, of having email attachments to email. Do you still do that? If you do, I have something I'd like to show you. Um, if you um, think about today, the work today is much more 
around collaboration, about working in parallel, working on whatever it is you're working on together, simultaneously, multi-user, in an environment that really is enabling you, your colleagues, your customers, your employees, suppliers, contractors, to ideate, to create, and make incredible things happen in a fully synchronized environment. That's what we believe in, and that's what we're trying to enable with Dropbox. We also appreciate, as I said earlier on, it's a difficult, challenging work world today. Too much of our time is spent trying to get it to work as opposed to working. We recognize that there's all these silos, all these different tools, and our challenge is, look, we want to help solve what companies are looking for, and that is a common platform. So we work with thousands of existing systems, many of them the larger ones you see here, which leads to those 2 billion daily API calls that I spoke about earlier on. We try to find a clever way that is bridging the gap between content and productivity, and many of the solutions you see here represent line of business, productivity apps, content-enabling solutions that are used across your customers and within your own, own organizations. And we continue to add to this list. This week alone, we announced uh, a partnership, an integration uh, with Facebook for their workplace solution uh, into Dropbox. So we continue to add to, list, to this list. We continue to innovate to ensure that getting work done is just easier, simpler, and not siloed. The strategy has worked. We are now at a point where, as I said, we have more than 200,000 organizations as paying Dropbox business and Dropbox enterprise customers across the world with more than 52% of the Fortune 500, uh, Fortune 500. They see and they understand the value of the platform I just spoke about. Now, I did want to share with you what it looks like in terms of industries, and how it all stacks up across such you know, interesting areas, such as media, technology, education. But it's also into industries that are, so to speak, highly regulated. One customer we're very proud of working with is in financial services, is NASDAQ, uh, who is leveraging our solution to ensure that the entire organization is in sync and can get work done. So, Let's talk a little bit about how can you take advantage, uh, advantage of these numbers. Half a billion plus registered users, eight million businesses every day where employees are bringing Dropbox in to get work done, and now more than 200,000 companies across the world as paying Dropbox business and Dropbox enterprise customers. Let's talk about that opportunity and what it represents for you. So, why sell it? Why go and work with your customers? Well, first of all, it's about selling made simple. The companies out there that you talk to, it could be your current customers, it could also be new customers where you can leverage Dropbox as that net new customer acquisition engine. It's really about making selling simple. And what is easier to get done than talking to companies that's already using the solution? So, the typical selling cycle actually is one of you talk to companies, you share with them what you can offer, the value of Dropbox business and enterprise, to folks out there, IT decision makers, business decision makers, moreover these days much more business decision makers. They understand the brand, they use the solution, they see the value. It's a pretty straightforward discussion. So it's made simple, it's about delighting customers, <clears throat> and it's around providing streamlined management. So let's try to talk a little bit about what that means. As I said, um, customers already know the product, they already love the product. It's a great opportunity to, for you to profit from the services opportunity, and, and of course, just in general, the cloud adoption. And moreover, to attach Dropbox to any other application or hardware cell you do into your existing uh, customer base. The services type examples is very much uh, along the lines of what Pam from IDC spoke about earlier on. So she's kind of done my job, thank you. Um, 
It was a very good setup. Uh, so you won't be surprised to see the type of services opportunities. It's very much around managed services, the subscription flow, training, and projects. Great opportunities to attach value here. Yesterday, um, uh, Victor Baez from Microsoft put a challenge out there to me, saying, hey, we should do something together, Dropbox, Microsoft. So, you know, I kind of was a step ahead of him. I had the slide ready. So here's what, at the power of Ingram's incredible cloud marketplace, here's how we do it for you, our joint resellers. Here are some of the bundles that Ingram had put together into the marketplaces to, to provide a better together type solution for you to provide to our joint customers. So Office 365, various type of uh, solutions together with Dropbox. So I encourage you to have a look at that in the, in, the, uh, in the marketplace and see how that can assist your customers. We, by the way, finding that when we look <clears throat> in Dropbox at what is sitting in our data centers, we actually have data centers with more files, Office files and Adobe files than those vendors themselves. That's the amount of traffic that's taking place through our network, through those 500, 500 million plus registered users that really are leveraging the notion of better together and the platform of Dropbox. On the notion of um, delighting customers, I, I want to talk a little bit about the products that we offer that can solve your customers' problems. So I'm not going to go into a deep, deep, deep technical discussion and features and, and so forth, but I want to talk about two recent addition to our services. It may say, sound straightforward, and it is straightforward for, you, for the users, but, but these are highly complex solutions that many other great software and cloud companies have tried to do and have failed at and are yet not offering. The first one I'd like to talk about is SmartSync. SmartSync we announced not that long ago, a few months ago. It really is your opportunity to, from <clears throat> your notebook, from your desktop, however small or large the drive on your device may be, is to see all of your work. It's an opportunity for you to access anything, everything that you want, just a click away. It's an opportunity for you to create space to work by easily sending files and folders to the cloud. It's actually an opportunity for you to get a hard drive that is infinitely sized. That hard drive sits in the cloud, courtesy of Dropbox, and you have the opportunity to smart sync, to choose what you want on your local drive, what you want on the cloud, but it provides you with the opportunity to have infinite possibilities of what you have access to. And when you think about that, combined also with our recent addition of a feature we call Team Folders, we actually have in market now a solution for you to go out and replace the classic file server. Now, this is business that many of you have done 10 years ago. I did it 20 years ago when I worked for Dell Computer. There's a wonderful opportunity here, leveraging SmartSync and Team Folder, to go out and replace the hundreds of thousands of file servers sitting across the US, sitting across the world, and getting them, uh, getting them migrated to the cloud, and you to build a very nice business around it with very strong ROI for your customers. I'd like to move on to uh, share with you our latest product um, we announced also back in, um, back, in, uh, back in January. It's Dropbox Paper. I encourage you to go online. I encourage you to visit our booth today if you have time. Uh, I encourage you to go and sign up and use the free version for it and see the power of it. Dropbox pa paper is a black canvas, is a blank canvas in a browser. And it allows you to create and ideate. It allows you to review and revise. It allows you to manage and organize real-time multi-user simultaneously. It is the place that really enables you to be super creative, to be effective, and to move away from the linear old way of working through email and other old school tools into a real time tool that really will unleash innovation. It's hard to describe. 
I won't bore you with a demo. We have limited time, but I encourage you to look online and come and visit our booth. Now, <clears throat> you saw earlier from the cloud marketplace that there's some very smart bundling taking place by Ingram. For example, in the case example I used of Office 365 and Dropbox together, all this good work and the great work of you have led to tremendous progress together uh, since you last heard from Dropbox a year ago from one of my colleagues. Over the past year, Dropbox through the channel had, have grown from a revenue perspective, net new ARR, by more than 100% triple digit year over year growth. The Dropbox partner network, that's you. Partners that are signing up to be part of addressing this tremendous opportunity has more than doubled in size. We have now grown the Dropbox partner network who is, that has only been in existence for 18 months to just shy of 5,000 partners. And look, this is just the beginning of something much larger. And for those of you that are not part of the Dropbox partner network, I encourage you to join, come to a booth and learn more about it. So the great business that's taking place it's only because we have partners like yourself. And I'd like to share with you a short video featuring the network doctor from Englewood Cliffs, New Jersey, to real time share with you what's possible. Can we roll the video, please? Whether it's a hurricane or a routine support issue, Network Doctor is here for our clients. I've worn every hat inside the company here. Day one, I started, I was the finance director and the IT director and the help desk technician. We manage all of our clients' IT infrastructure. Clients are hungry for an easier way to share files. Having a tool like Dropbox just makes it easier for a client to grow because they don't need to worry about infrastructure. They can have their files wherever they are. As a managed service provider, we need to have the best tools in our toolbox to help our clients. Dropbox is one of those tools in our arsenal. It's just something that is easy to sell, easy to use, easy to transition and easy to teach. We're constantly measuring all of our performance metrics. By having tools like Dropbox, we're able to support more clients with less resources on our end, which ultimately saves us money and brings more money to the bottom line. We've moved into hyper growth mode in the last five years. Dropbox has helped us grow up to 5,000 end users that we're now supporting and 1,900 servers that we have under management. It's just made life easier. What we've heard from our clients using Dropbox, it is achieving their goals. It's helping them grow. As a managed service provider, Dropbox is a no-brainer. All right, thank you. So, uh, look, um, nearly 5,000 partners in our network. I hope to be here in a year's time from now, and that number is 10, 15,000, and we'll continue to push on that front. We are an organization that's partner-centric. We believe in putting our partners first. We believe that the only way you can scale into the millions of companies across the world is through you uh, partners. We want to make sure that you get a great business together with Dropbox. We believe our, our offering is very simple, straightforward. We can provide you margin and stickability increased into your current customer set and also secondly act as an accelerator for net new customer acquisition given we have more than half a billion registered users. So with that, Briefly on the network, you get sales marketing material, you get training, you get internal licenses, an opportunity to go out and receive leads as you, as, you, uh, as you graduate through the different tiers of our program. I encourage you to come and stop by our booth today to attend some of the sessions we are running this afternoon where you can learn more about our network, the opportunity. I encourage you to register as a partner and if you have any questions, I'm just a click away on a linear old school email. You can find me at thomas at dropbox.com. Thank you for your attention. Thank you for your time. Have a wonderful morning. Cheers.